I went around Dallas and like bothered bartenders for their boss's email and shit and sent them my little videos and got a Friday gig at this place. And then um, basically doing the same shit I'm doing now. And I you would set, set up. up. Yeah. Because some of the tapes, some of the videos of you, I call them tapes because I'm, yeah. so, I'm <laughs> 77 years young. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, some of these videos, you look, they look like fucking Buffalo Wild Wings. Yeah. <laughs> I want to be in that girl's club. I want to be in that girl's club. Like, they're not venues. They're not perfect. Maybe they are, but they don't <laughs> oh, they're, look like venues. They're to not. Me. They're not venues. It's a restaurant or it's, uh, yeah, it's you like a brunch at, crowd. You're bothering people. Yes. Oh, 100%. You dude. might as well be handing out flyers. Yeah. <laughs> Like yeah. you're, it's not like it's like people are not like they're not there for you. They are a hundred percent not there for me. Often do not want me to be there. They would have preferred you try to sell them real estate. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, than, exactly. Then you do what you were doing. They're eating a fucking sandwich. Yeah, they're trying to order like another <laughs> beer, and yeah. I'm like, pussy, pussy, <laughs> let me in. I'm trying to fuck. You know, yeah. and it's just not. What did you think your first show was going to be? What was your loose plan? I, I I really didn't have much of one. I mean, I like, I just, I have never really had much of one. It's sort of set the table up, set the keyboard up, make sure it sounds decent. Jesus is here. And then let's just. Let just roll. Don't forget about love over there. I'm just going to fucking roll, you know, and it's like I would just use what I was thinking about that week. If I'd seen a movie or I wanted to like rail on a director or whatever, just what's happening at this table over here. And it's just always been like very abrasive and uh, often unpleasant. But I think <laughs> there's like there was something about it. It really hasn't changed much. Yeah, just that I don't really either. You know, that's sort of what it is. Yeah, it's like, the, actually, someone told me that the other night, last night, actually, they were like, we went to your show and we weren't sure if you were the main guy. Like, we thought you were the opener or something. We just weren't sure that you were supposed to be we on stage. I couldn't believe this many people would come <laughs> to, for to this. See this. I'm running around screaming at everyone. You know, it's just like, but that's exactly the reaction, I think it's like once I did it once at some random It only bar, has to work once. Exactly. And then, you, then you probably just have to get in that spirit. Right, right. And sort of then you're fine tuning. Then you're like, okay, let me twist this dial a little this way. Like, does this work? This doesn't work. And then you sort of, yeah, it's just like by trial and error, you do it again and again and again. I'm sure you know this. Do you stand bomb? Up. Do you, are there shows that are significantly worse than others? For sure. Definitely. Are they getting less often? Yes. I would say now. Good. Yeah. <laughs> right. That would kind of suck. But I'm saying like, Still you know, all right, so you don't, you must have gotten a loop that wasn't, you must have looped something that was a little fucked up. Oh yeah. And people are like, ah, I'm not feeling like they. hundred percent. And you just like, re is there a reset function? Yeah, that's what I usually do. Now it's like, I've learned that that, w and that people like, they want to see that fuck up you know and like it they want to see it acknowledged so i fuck up i'm like i don't fucking like this where that's it erase yeah. it we're starting again and that's just it you know it's yeah. like it's sloppy but they, it's it's interesting because it makes them they're kind of in the band with you yeah exactly where yeah, they're yeah, kind of yeah. like nah, i'm not feeling it. <laughs> yeah that's they don't a good say way that to put but it. it's like they get to be in the in like what do you else Play me another loop. Right, right. What else? What, yeah, what like are we doing? they get to be Jay Z with Timberland, where it's like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, nah, yeah, whatever. What else? What else you got? Hey, yeah, you wanna tweet that? Uh, bang, 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 bang. How much? What was the first video to get like hundred thousand? How what, the first video, second video? What? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. It would have been. I mean, I tried like maybe a dozen, and then I scrapped them all and started doing a different thing. And from those, it started. You know, I would post some to to Reddit to like the video subreddit. And one or two of those would would go, and then so those you, you're talking maybe twenty forty thousand views something like that, and then 2018 I'm starting to play these shows in Dallas at the restaurants and shit. I moved back to you New York. Worked some of Dallas's finest restaurants. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. That's right. <laughs> Congratulations. That's why I brought you, you here. So Congratulations. Much. I'm one of the great restaurant loopers. <laughs> Residencies. It's a big deal. 
It's a big it's a, deal. And I'm here to tell you, yeah. it's a very big deal. <laughs> Um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, once I hit a wall there, then I moved. To, I, I used to live in New York for a bit, and then I moved back because I was like, you know, I I, I got to this point where I was playing these residencies, whatever you want to call it, at these bars and restaurants and starting to fill them out. And so then I was like, let me try and see if I can do a hard ticket show at a venue. No one, no venue at Dallas wanted in Dallas wanted to do it, wouldn't have it. So I was like. I'm going to go back to New York. Didn't matter. You could have put the money up yourself or they just didn't want to have point, you. Gi- they didn't want to give you a night and risk it. They just didn't want to give me a night. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. So I moved to New York and then somewhere in there, Facebook, th- I was putting the videos up there at the same time. And within a week, those a selection, three or four of those videos went from 20, 30,000 views to like 5 million. Yeah. Just like bang. Yeah. And multiple and I didn't know what the fuck was going on. Then I started getting requests like, come play here, come play right. there. And then, so yeah, then I signed with a booking agency and they wrangled it into like a very messy tour. And so then I was working and that's and, basically been touring ever. Do you pr- try to prepare for shows? Is it about clearing your mind or not clearing it, or having a little plan? I, it's, I think yeah, I like to have a little seed. It's yeah. like, it's like if I can somewhat figure out just a basic, even if it's a phrase, or like um, just a general thought uh, to get the thrust underway right up top, the show is much better off. I have nothing else. I basically go up. I try to go up with like a thing. Is that usually the thing you open with? Yeah. Yeah. And then it's you'll the take top. the confidence of that. And then we're and then, and then we're start rolling. shitting on people's pants. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Making songs about how what they he doesn't deserve that girl, et cetera, et cetera. <laughs> right. Right. Um, and he doesn't. And <laughs> let me be clear. Yeah. Hey, did you like that? Did you like that? Yeah. Did you like it though? You want more? Don't want to work? Would rather watch videos of me grab assing with people? First of all, go up here to subscribe, and then go up here to uh, watch more clips. This is like when the weatherman says that there's a high pressure system coming in. I'm, a little, I'm not really used to the green screen.